All right, so this is all the parts for the laser communicator. We have a tool right here for your wire cutter, which is very important to have. You can use scissors, but if you're really only if you're really gentle because you can easily snip off the wires. So let's go through all the parts I have listed right here. And the first thing is your three uh, AA battery holder, which holds three AA's. And you can get this from online anywhere or if your Radio Shack does hold it, but I, di I didn't find anything at my local Radio Shack. And for all these parts, it'll be listed in the description with the links. And you have your laser right here, very, very relatively cheap quality, nothing, doesn't really matter what type of laser, as long as you can access the spring and that's basically it. Um, you have your audio output transformer with all your wires that are color coded and you have your Radio Shack audio amplifier. I recommend getting this, I don't, I'm not sure what would substitute it with because it's an audio amplifier can't use a regular like your iPhone speaker or something like that. You have your solar cell. This is an encapsulated one because the regular ones that don't come encapsulated are very, very delicate and can break very easily. So I recommend getting the encapsulated one with two lead clips, uh, two lead wires coming out of it, which is easier. Saves you time from soldering two, two of them onto the solar cell. Now you have a bunch of lead clips. I bought like a 10 pack. So this comes very handy because you don't have to solder the wires onto the, uh, the main electronics and you can just test it out. So you also have your 3.5 millimeter jack wires. These are two of them, which is what you'll need. And you can find at Radio Shack as well or online. So now let's start connecting all of these parts together. Okay. so. Here's a closer look at the laser and how we're going to connect everything. So you have your laser right here and you can see the spring inside there. We're going to take the black wire and connect the spring in there. And then we're going to take a red wire and connect the ground on the outside. As you can get it right there. So now let's focus it and we're going to connect our battery pack and the audio trans uh, output transformer with all these things together. Now we need another lead clip right here connecting to the white, which is going to connect to the black right here. So right there, you got your secure connection. Okay, and now you're going to connect your black with the red on here for your power. And then you're going to be connecting your red lead clip with the red wire right here. Or whichever color lead clip you do have. So now everything is connected. You're going to turn your battery on and your laser works. So that you got basically half of the whole thing half of the project already done. Now we're gonna connect your black, I mean your blue and green wires with your 3.5 millimeter jack wire. Now it doesn't matter which end you use with these two, which ones you connect, it'll still work. So we're just gonna connect the, this red one and here's our other end white. So now those are two connected. Now you're going to have your audio output transformer. You can just connect to every one. And there you go. Now that works and your laser will still work and everything is good. Your laser is complete. It's all working. And now we're going to connect the solar encapsulated solar um, cell with your audio amplifier. Now we're going to use, this is relatively simple, you got your red, connect the red, with the red and lead clip, and then the black, the black. These are thicker wires, so it's easier to hold on to. And then you got your 3.5 millimeter jack right here. And 
again, doesn't matter. Just connect both of them. And then you're gonna plug it in. And remember this took me a while to figure out, I don't know why. I had to unscrew this screw right here and open it up and put a nine volt battery in here. So just make sure to do that and to turn it on. Now we'll use my phone to play some music. Hopefully YouTube doesn't block it. All right, so my media player, my iPhone, playing some music. You got your solar panel right here. And it works. And you can control the audio. So there you go. This is a simple laser communicator. You can plug a microphone into this output input right here and it'll still work. So there you have it. This is your laser communicator and I'll have all the links in the description below. This is RK2 Productions. Rate, comment, subscribe. Peace out.